Hello, guys. Teacher. Hello, teacher. Hi, good, good evening. evening. It feels like forever since I last saw you, <laughs> and it's only been three days. Uh, How are you doing? I uh, super. Fine, thank you. Super good, Hector. I'm fine. I am good. great. great. <laughs> Wilson. I I am good. Did you? Tired. <laughs> <laughs> See my big dark circle. Hey, everyone's here. Selena, Fernando, Ana Giron. Welcome. Good evening. Nice seeing you again. Good evening, Have you teacher. Practiced? Nice to see you. Thanks. Good evening. Hi. Have you practiced um, indirect questions? Uh, yes, I do a little. <laughs> Just a little bit. A little practice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, most of you did you the too. homework. That's great. All right. Well, we're going to change topics tonight. Yeah, I'm going to share the screen with you. <coughs> All right. Let me see. Miss mm, Ana Hiron, can you read the objective, please? Uh, build your English language skill with this lesson. An adjective and noun. By the end of this class, you will learn how to express your opinion about the house and apartment. Personality, you will be able to apply to describe your house or apartment in English and use evaluating phrases such as apartment are too small for pet, house are too expensive or how the cost too much money houses right and this is able able Able. Right. Able. Okay. Able. Able. Yes. We're going to be watch. Able. Exactly. To be able to do something. Right. We're going to watch a video about evaluating uh, using adjectives and nouns. So that might be the only explanation you will have since it's very lengthy. It's about 10 minutes. So I would say pay close attention, please. So hopefully we don't need more explanation. If you need it, of course, I'm here. But try to pay attention and note if you can. If you have your notebook handy, then take notes, please. I'm going to, I'm going to play it for everyone, so please mute the microphones and listen up. The end of this class, you will be able to give your opinion about houses and apartments. Additionally, you'll be mute the microphones, to please. On house and apartment. For example, you'll be able to make the following statements. Apartments are too small for pets, but houses are too expensive. Houses cost too much money. Before I talk about the grammar involved in this particular class, what I would like to do now is I would like to play an audio program which illustrates how this topic is used. We will listen to a few people you will be able to give your opinion about houses and apartments. Additionally, you'll be able to evaluate your own house and apartment. For example, you'll be able to make the following statements. Apartments are too small for pets, but houses are too expensive. Houses cost too much money. Before I talk about the grammar involved in this particular class, what I would like to do now is I would like to play an audio program which illustrates how this topic is used. We will listen to a few people talk about their opinions on houses and apartments. Your task is to listen carefully and answer a couple of questions that I'll have for you at the end of the audio program. Apartments are too small for pets. Apartments aren't big enough for families. Apartments don't have enough parking spaces. Apartments have just as many expenses as houses. Apartments don't have as many rooms as houses. Houses aren't as safe as apartments. Houses aren't as convenient as apartments. Houses cost too much money. Houses don't have enough closet space. 
Houses don't have as much privacy as apartments. Let me present some structure now. The first thing that I would like to do is to show you how to make evaluations using adjectives. And particularly, we're going to learn how to use the words enough and to. After that, we're going to make evaluations, but this time we're going to use nouns. And at the same time, we're also going to use the words enough and also to. First of all, what are adjectives? Well, adjectives are those words that describe nouns. So they describe people, places, or things. Since we're talking about evaluating houses and apartments, what we want to do is we want to think about some of those adjectives that we might use to evaluate a house or an apartment. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to write a lot of those words here. And then what I would like for you to do is to uh, memorize this and maybe study them if you're not familiar with them. So for example, we have the adjectives comfortable, convenient, dangerous, dark, bright, expensive, huge, small, inconvenient, modern, noisy, private, quiet, safe, small, special. And I'm pretty sure you can think of many more. Let me present some structure at this time on how to make sense of this evaluation that you see there towards the left. Apartments aren't big enough for families. So in order for us to make that particular evaluation, we can think of the following structure. So let me go ahead and write that now. Following this structure, we can see that we're going to have a subject. So in this case, we have apartments. This is followed by the verb to be. In this case, it happens to be in its negative form. Okay. And then, and then this is going to be followed by the adjective. So in this case, the adjective is big. Then this is going to be followed by enough. And then um, we're going to have some sort of complement here. So in this case, it happens to be families, right? So if we look at the pattern, we have a subject. I'm going to go ahead and follow the colors so that we can see what's happening there. That's in black. There we go. So we can see that the subject is apartments. Then this is followed by the verb to be. In this case, it happens to be the verb to be in its negative form. After that, we're going to have some sort of adjective. And then it's going to follow the word enough. And then we're going to include um, some sort of complement, if you will. So if we think about other evaluations that we can say about apartments, either apartments or homes, then we can say the following. I'm going to go ahead and copy this because the next evaluation is going to be quite similar. So we can say the following. Apartments aren't, and so I'm going to change the adjective here. So I'm going to say aren't spacious enough for families. Okay. And let's do one more. Uh, we can also say that apartments aren't and I'm going to change the adjective now. I'm going to say apartments aren't comfortable enough for families. The next thing that I would like to do is to make sense of that second evaluation that you see there at the bottom. Now using the word to. And so what I want you to notice is the following. That we're just going to have different ways of evaluating things. And so there isn't just one way to do it. There are many different ways. So in this case, we're going to use this expression. And I want you to notice what's going to change. So I want you to think about what is the opposite of big? Well, the opposite of big, we can, we can think of that as being small, right? So in this case, I want you to notice what, what's going to change. So in this case, I'm going to say apartments are. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to include two small. So the only thing that changes is that I'm no longer using the bird to be in its negative form, but now I'm using it in its positive form. And then I'm including two plus the adjective small. And I'm saying for families. So what I want you to notice is that these two sentences these two evaluations are the same thing. The only thing is that I'm expressing them in different ways. 
the next thing that I would like to do now is to show you how to make evaluations but now we're going to talk about making evaluations using nouns and a couple of things will change and so let me present the formula at this time and I'm going to show you what kind of things will change well first of all um, similar to making evaluations with adjectives we're going to have a subject so in this case we're going to say apartments okay that's going to follow a verb in this case it's no longer the verb to be so that's the first thing that changes we're no longer using the verb to be so in this case we're using any other kind of verb in this case it happens to be that that's on a negative so we, we're going to say don't have that's uh, the verb is on its negative form and then this follows enough so opposite from adjectives where we would include the adjective first when we make evaluations using nouns we no longer use the adjective first we're going to include enough and then we're going to include the noun so let me give an example here don't have enough and then uh, whatever um, noun that we want to include so in this case don't have enough parking spaces okay uh, so the noun is parking spaces and then you can think of a complement if you will so you can include something else there so for example uh, what could that be don't have enough parking spaces for people right that could be the complement but in this case the noun is parking spaces and quickly I want to talk about nouns so what are nouns what are some of the nouns that we can think about when we are um, you know thinking about making evaluations of apartments and houses well uh, we can think of things like parking spaces as you can see there we can think of things like closet space right we can think of things like privacy and of course we can think of things like money if you will right so this kind of things are nouns that we can think of so we can say the following apartments don't have enough parking spaces apartments don't have enough closet space apartments don't have enough privacy and the last example that I would like to make is how to use to so in this case what I'm going to do is I'm going to say well this I'm going to take that example there houses this follows the verse so that continues to be the same we are no longer going to include the word enough so in this case we're going to use too much money right houses cost too much money so if we can think of this I'm going to follow the pattern there houses cost that follows the verb and then in this case I want you to notice what happened so we include too much money the last thing that I would like for you to do now is to evaluate your house or apartment it depends on where you live right and I want you to evaluate your house or apartment using adjectives such as the ones that are here and of course following the formula that I presented to you earlier today and I also want you to evaluate your house or apartment using noun so uh, once again using the formula that I'm presenting to you today and then of course you're gonna follow this formula so I want you to make as many examples as you possibly can the idea is to practice as much as possible. All right, did you get the main idea of how to conjugate those? I hope so. <laughs> you can unmute the microphone, all right? Did you get a small idea of it? Okay. We're going to start practicing. <coughs> Guys, I have feedback with one of you. It's really noisy. Este es un anuncio okay. sobre una herramienta de gestión de proyectos llamada monday.com. Así es como se ve. Sorry. It's a bicycle. No, I think someone is outside, I don't know. Let's mute the microphone because it, it gets very loud. All right. Uh, we're going to practice first with with adjectives, okay? Do you have any questions about that video, by the way? 
No, teacher. No, no. any question. Hold on. Give me, <laughs> Give me one second. Hold on. Okay. Okay, done. So we're gonna start practicing with the adjectives. And as you know, I prefer if you learn through practice, right? That's what we're gonna do first. So we're going to discuss questions such as, for example, um, are, hey, have you heard about the donuts <laughs> that they had cockroaches <laughs> inside? <laughs> Cockroaches feel donuts, Mr. Donuts. So, mm. are donuts? Okay, we're gonna practice with this as, uh, and then we need an adjective as, uh, and something else, all right, to compare that both of them are either the same or not, but it makes it equal. All right, give me another, another dish or dessert. Tell me something else. Cupcakes. Cupcakes, okay. So, what adjective can I use? Uh, delicious. Delicious. Okay, I'm sending, hold on. Yeah, I'm sending you some images right now. Yeah, right there. All right, so if I ask you, are donuts as delicious as cupcakes, what would you say? Depends. Yes, yes, they are. <laughs> they are? <laughs> yes, they are. And depends. somebody said it depends, right, on why and why. You start discussing. So I just want you to practice this single structure right now. And later on, we're going to practice the rest, okay? So I sent some questions to the group. We're going to discuss those. But I want you to try to speak more, all right? Not just simply say yes or no, but give details and an explanation. So we're going to work in small groups of three. Any questions before we do that? Everybody check what's up. Questions? No? I guess you're ready then. Okay. I no. the invitation. Let's practice. Okay. Alguien tiene mal el micrófono. Se oye un ruido bien feo. And Jill and Mauricio, accept the invitation, please. Do you agree or disagree? Why? It's number one. Si estamos de acuerdo o no, y por qué? Men are as yellow, yellows as women, si los hombres son más celosos que las mujeres. Do you agree or disagree? Why? Right, although that is not a comparison <coughs> like that. It doesn't say more jealous. It says as jealous, jealous as. Jealous. Tan celosos como. It, it's not more. Ah. Uh, yeah, so you have to say, I think they are as jealous as are, women yes. or la la la. I, I, I think that uh, the women are more yellow, yellow that, that men. Um, uh, Let's practice. Yes, I have uh, many slides with information to discuss. Yes, it is. 
The mm. first is indoor activities are as fun as outdoor activities. Do you agree or disagree? Why? Can you start, Rina? Uh, what do you have to do? I just came, sorry, I don't know what, what we are doing. Rina, check the, the, the images that I sent to WhatsApp, so you're going to discuss those questions. Uh, there okay. are statements we're practicing as big as, as convenient uh so we're practicing adjectives comparing like that so you will start reading the questions and everybody will discuss and see or share the opinion okay the the woman as are jealous than men in that case, Way it's more. double. It is as jealous as. You have to use both. As okay. big as. as um, so you have to both, use as. Uh, I think, so, so I think that both are jealous. No, I think that women are as jealous as men. As jealous as. You have to use as, as, and the adjective in between. Just like the example. Look at the, the slides. So you have to say it like that. Okay. Or you're going to say that it is more or less, depending on what your opinion is. Okay. So I think uh, both are yellows. But depend of the... Has intelligent as box. For <laughs> me, is more intelligent uh, the cat. Uh, the cat. Uh, Mauricio, please. Uh, Hello, the teacher. is for Hi. Fernando. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Okay, uh, I think that uh, it depends. I think cats are very, like, uh, how do you say, independent teacher? But independent. 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 I think cats are very independent. And cats are very. Yes, are very. Very independent. Yes. Very independent, <laughs> yes. <laughs> and dogs uh, are... Uh, the, the, opposite, have, the, the opposite. The opposite. It's the very, opposite. very dependent. Dependent. Very dependent. Subir, subir un árbol, teacher, como se dice? Climb a tree. What? Climb a tree. Climb. Climb a tree. Climb a tree. I Climb. hear man, the, mango. I the hear cat, mango tree. The cat. <laughs> the cat. And why? Why, Christian? Um. Because the cat is very fast and very um, you need mm -hmm. with a word. Do you need help with vocabulary? Yes. Uh, what word are you looking for? Es que no sé cómo se dice ni siquiera en español. Oh, cool. <laughs> audaces, audaces. Uh, I don't know, fast, um, smart. 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 <laughs> okay, smart. Okay, in my case, I uh, disagree because... I disagree. I disagree, sorry. I disagree. Mm, I disagree. I think both are intelligent. Just, the thing is, the cats are more. Um, how do you say it again? Lazy. Lazy. Okay. Uh, cats are, are more lazy than dogs. When, when the cat is male, Maybe. Next. Do you agree or disagree? Why? <coughs> Roxana. Rihanna is as 
beautiful as Beyonce. Uh, equals. That that means equal, actually. Do you agree? So yeah, that would be like I agree. I think that Rihanna is as beautiful as la la la, because as and as means equal. Equal. For me, it's equal. Uh, okay, so let's say Rihanna is as beautiful as Beyonce. Say it. Equal both. Equal yeah. both. Yeah, yeah, but you have to say as, as. That means equal. Mm -hmm. It's not more, it's not less, equal, it's as, yes. as. That means equal. So, uh, it's same teacher, means, means, mm -hmm. ¿Es correcto decir I am disagree? No, I disagree. I disagree. Mm -hmm. ah, I will send I disagree a, a message. Because I, I think that Bijong is more beautiful than Rihanna. <laughs> I, I agree. I Sí, sí. Eh, sí. They, they are similar, similar characteristics. Mm. For me. Ah. Would a uh, uh, has light and it's more, more big. Um, it's more um, white. Um, and you had a bad experience with the uh, love. Have you had a bad experience? Me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> It's a little bit as powerful as eight. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Okay. And, it's, it's and you? Comp you keep the <laughs> uh, Yes. And you, okay. Edgar? Uh, no, I, I, I no, am. I am. Ah, okay. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? <laughs> I I phone in my ham. Uh, okay, that's okay. Diana, uh, would you ask a question? Yeah. Do you have the questions and at, at the WhatsApp? Uh, yes. Fernando, uh, uh, Fernando, the next next is for Diana. Yes. Okay. Okay, uh, Diana, go ahead. Can I, Hi for you, Diana. Hi. The, 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 the question is, women are as Hi, Diana. Are as men. Do okay. you agree or disagree and why? I agree. <laughs> Excellent question for you, you know. <laughs> yes. I... <laughs> and why? Can you tell us why? <laughs> <laughs> because I think that all women and men are uh, the same uh, capacity and abilities and we can work as hard as you and, and we can do uh, the work in in maybe in different ways but who is Diana Rihanna, Rihanna. Oh, Rihanna. One moment, one moment. Uh, me too. I research. Canción de Rihanna. No. <laughs> Beyonce. Beyonce, you, you know. Sí. Sí. Rihanna. No sé quién es Rihanna. Rihanna. <laughs> search in YouTube. If you know uh, Beyonce, I, I, I search later. Okay. Okay. I see you tomorrow. <laughs> okay. And <laughs> <laughs> you, Alisa, what do you think? Um, I'm disagree. 
and um, this woman are are beauty are beauty beautiful and beautiful teacher we finish yeah i was going to ask you that <laughs> we're going back all righty did you guys practice I guess only only one group finished. The rest of you, I know you were still speaking. So uh, some of you were confused on how to use. Can you see my screen? Yes. 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 Right. When we use this, right? Um, mm, hold on. So when we use as la 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 as, we're saying that they are basically the same, right? Yes. For example. Let me see. Um, my finance fee. I'm gonna ask everybody your age. You wanna share that, or you know what? I'm gonna ask something else. I'm gonna ask, for example, how many? Because this is what we're gonna practice right now. How many siblings do you have? Mm -hmm. How many siblings do you have? Everyone, tell me. I have two. What is that? Hermano. What sibling? What is the meaning of sibling? Hermanos? Means brothers and, and sisters. And sisters. Okay. It's like brothers. Okay. I have around 16. Okay, we're going to practice with many and much in a second. All right. So imagine, imagine, right, that we're comparing Carolina. Can you see Carolina? Yeah. <laughs> and we're comparing, who else mm -hmm. has the camera on? Uh, Guadalupe. Okay. So we're trying to compare how, how intelligent they are. All right. So we're, we have Guadalupe versus... Guys, the dog. The dog. The, the dog well, please. versus Carolina. All right. And you guys don't want to say, right? Oh, one of them is more intelligent than the other, but we're going to say that they're equal, right? How do you make that sentence? We're not going to use more. Yeah. Mm -mm. We're not going to use less. All right. We're going to say they're equal. How do you say that? Guadalupe well, well, is. Yes. Yeah. Intel uh, is as intelligent is, is, as, intelligent as, as Carolina. 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 Perfect. So that means they're equal, right? And this is what you practice. I hope that because you practice, you understand this, all right? But this, we're using an adjective. Now, this is done, guys. Now what you're going to practice is quantity, whether it is countable or uncountable, okay? So many... Do we use many for countable or non-countable, guys? Countable. 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 countable all right. And in match, we use it for? No countable. No countable. No countable. No countable, right. Countable. I'm just going to say uncountable. Uncountable. All right. So now we're going to practice with this. And still, we're going to use a ass, all right? So how do we say that? Hey, Anna, Hiron, how many siblings do you have? Or how many brothers do you have, for example? I have about two... Only brothers, not siblings, brothers. Two bro brothers. Two Only brothers. Two brothers. Okay, two guys, brothers. is that countable or uncountable? Countable. Countable. Okay, Fernando, do you have brothers? I, I have sisters. <laughs> uh, Diana, brothers? No brothers who, and no sister. Who has two brothers? Me. Who? Who? What is your name? Crisia. Crisia. Okay, listen. Crisia has two brothers in Anahiron. Okay. So look. Look at this, guys. So Anahiron, two brothers, right? And Crisia has two brothers as well. So how can we make this comparison if it is accountable? How do we say that, guys? Uh, 
Anna Hiram has many brothers as Chrysia. As brother as Chrysia. Two brother. How oh, many? Anna has. As many. As many. Has as many brothers. Brothers. As. Crisia. Más hermanos que Cris. Soy igual. Oh, Teacher, teacher, teacher. I can hear you. Teacher. I can hear you. For, for, for me, both ha, are two brothers. Yes. And if you want to brother, Chris are two brothers. Yes. I can say only Anna has as brother as Crisia. No, 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 no many. No many. For me. Anna has as brother. The same, igual. Come back to chair. How oh, many? How oh, much? Sugar. Mm, coffee. And a countable. Uncountable. Fernando continues with the class, please. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how much sugar? <laughs> well, let's add two <laughs> teaspoons of sugar. Nice coffee. I don't use sugar. On my coffee. <laughs> no sugar. Oh. No sugar. That's a, that's a really black coffee. Yes. <laughs> it's, del I prefer it's delicious. No sugar. No sugar. No sugar. Yes. In the morning, I write. It's right. It's strong coffee. Let's put the sugar. Okay. Yes, much uncountable. Many countable. The teacher. Teacher Luz, where the teacher? <laughs> <laughs> the teacher is, is gone. The teacher has no audio, I think. You are muted, teacher. Yes, I. <laughs> See only writing, writing. No, we cannot hear you. He's muting. If, if we the send a message in the chat. I know you cannot Don't hear. Worry. We are. Uh, <laughs> the the teacher. Okay. The, the teacher be of language. <sighs> 
<laughs> as much as an as Okay, I, let's practice. So, okay, let's practice. I think she's gonna send us something for WhatsApp. Yes, WhatsApp. Who, who is great? What? Who is great? Mm. Start. Parece una figura ahí. Hello. Hello, guys. Countable or uncountable first. Okay, yes. the first the one is, is if the picture is countable or uncountable, uncountable first. Okay, start okay. The, the, the first one, sisters. Sisters. Countable. Sisters. Countable. Yes. Pets. Countable. Pets. Let's go. Okay. Hello, guys. But, but I think we have to do the the sentences for the first one. Okay. For example, I have my pets. issues. Uh, no, the pets, first one pets, is sisters. Sisters, yes, sisters. sisters. Um, Contable. Could you start, Fernando? Okay. I have. Uh, I have many sisters as mm, I don't know <laughs> who have who have sisters. I have. I have. Uh, how many have sisters two. do you have? I I have one one sister. Uh, and you? I have. I have four I sisters. Have four. Sisters. Four. Four sisters. Yeah. Yes. Could you imagine you, that? You. My my. My sisters, my sisters have as many friends as me. Okay, she has as many friends uh, as me. Yes. Okay. Uh, the next picture, uh, Oscar. What do you think, Pit? Is a uh, countable or uncountable? I think it's a uh, and is. Uh -huh. I think. I think uh -huh. I have. I have as many sisters as Juan, for example. For example. That's, that's okay. Okay. Yeah, I think. <laughs> Okay, Next. let's try with, with pets. 
Uh, Next is pets. Contable? Contable. Or... Is as as much expensive. Is as... no, is no because shoes is plural. Many mm. two two plural. Too many. What is the correct correct sentence? <laughs> uh... Uh, for example, for example, teacher sending. I have as many shoes as Rina. Mm -hmm. Because shoes is plural. I have as many shoes as Rina. Shoes as Rina, Yo yes. Tengo. como Rina. I do. Okay. Entonces, I have as. No, sí, se sí, puede. Entonces, choose as many Spencer as jacket. Okay. As many Spencer. Choose as many Spencer. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. I... Carolina sent as many emails as Mauricio. No, pero es it. It. As it. 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 As many. Many. As many fruits as Oksana. The exercise say not many, but. 
he write many, not many. Tia, many. T, 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 T is T. no countable. Non countable. No countable. No countable. The, the question that Saria, how many tea do you drink? No, uh, many is countable. How much tea do you drink in the okay. week? Oh, in for this, for week. In this case, uh, we can use many or much. Lydia. There's more, much free time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, the next, uh, the next um, picture. Uh, Rina, uh, Money, what do you think? Is it carnival or non carnival? Money is carnival and. Um, Houses and much uh, are costing much money as apartment. Hello. 